Good evening everyone, my name is HD Elder and I'm here to show you a guide on re-rolling and for first timers who are just getting into the game now on what you should do, what you should re-roll to. Like right now I'm using blue stacks, I recommend using blue stacks because unless you're on the go then you're, you're on your phone but for re-rollers I recommend blue stacks mainly because um it's objectively better. And then it's on PC. So now, hopefully, the game won't crash this time, so I can give like a proper tutorial. <clears throat> this is from a clear file, so I recommend. So I'm not. I don't really do the whole giveaway file or anything like that. You you just better off just rerolling yourself. So it's just to show you what you should do. Cause there are some differences from what it used to do used to be and for what it's like now. Also, I forgot to turn on the music. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's let's just say you're a new player now, and then it's like, wow, like this is my first time playing this game. You can watch the intro if you want to. Obviously, I'm not. Did I delete my data? Okay, good. <clears throat> you can delete your data. How you re-roll is if you don't get the re-rolls you want, go to data, delete account. Do not link it to your Facebook. Always go as guests. Always. Hopefully it doesn't crash. Okay. <clears throat> oh, sorry. I'm not. I'm not a professional guy, so work with me. Also, you notice that little part right there. Um, ignore that little part. Look, I'm um. This is another blue stage. This is my main blue stage. My main blue stage has my account. Hopefully it it goes through and then it doesn't um like stays on the connection. Are you gonna load? Are you gonna do it? Ah. Come on, guide. <laughs> this is a, another trend of blue stacks. It does do this. You can do this from phone, by the way. Yeah, I think it's on. <laughs> it crashed. <laughs> oh god, we're gonna be stuck at that already. Let's try this again. I'm not redoing this. <laughs> Like this is my um second attempt at recording this because I um said some wrong things. So uh Alright, let's try this again. <clears throat> Take two. Please don't freeze. Alright. You wanna go to new game? You can read term of service and stuff like that if you want to. I don't really care about those. Just go to agree. Obviously, you're going to pick I am 16 years old and older. I can't imagine what happens if you pick this. It might kick you out of the game. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's just to receive personalized um, advertising. So, um, we're not 12-year-olds, so we're adults or 16-year-olds, I guess, if you are. You can go to personalized where you can get, like, your own type of advertising. Or you get non-personalized. I'm just gonna pick personalized anyway, cause why not? Do not pick login to Facebook if you are a first timer. If you want to re-roll and get a certain certain unit, <clears throat> go to guest. Trust me, cause once you link it to your Facebook, you can never unlink it. You have to create another Facebook. As you can tell right here, we got our name. Got it. The generic name Anna. Um, let's just pick a name. There we go. Okay. You can watch the tutorial if you want to. We're not because I'm not going to sit through that. I recommend sitting through the tutorial if you're a new player because um you can learn some new tricks and learn the game mechanics. We're not. I'm merely showing you how to re-roll on your account and explaining the shops. That's it. I'm not going to sit through a tutorial. <laughs> no, no. Now this is different from your usual tutorial, mainly because back then when you started a new account, they would throw you into a mission as soon as you summon your 99 unit. Now they changed that. Now you don't have to do that anymore. You just gotta sit through the um buff up um month a couple of times, then that's it. I'm gonna show you. 
Hello, Ramada. Oh, whoops. <laughs> oh, those would have been bad if I would have remembered my string. Okay, as you can tell, yeah. You get your first unit. Um, You can reroll for your first unit. I wouldn't recommend again with it. Unless you get Laswell, then reroll because like, you don't have his sword. And Laswell is only good when you have his sword. And anything else is just not it's subpar. So I recommend re um, like rerolling if you get Laswell. Anybody else works besides Laswell, in my opinion. All right, let's see. You get your standard. Oh, we got a gold book. You get your bronze, your silver, and your gold. We got a gold book. So this might be spicy. Oh, oh no, no, it's not. <laughs> it's same thing. Oh, whatever, whatever. Either way, you you are guaranteed a 99 unit, and they're fixed. By the way, okay, we get garbage. Rare units you kind of want to avoid. You get Ramada no matter what. No matter what, you get Ramada. <clears throat> no matter what, you get um, Cacturn, Summon. You get another garbage unit. I don't care what anyone says, he's garbage. Murmur is not garbage. She's actually pretty good. I actually like Murmur. Okay. We get Snake Boy. We get a really good super rare unit. She is probably the best super rare unit in the game. All right, now let's get our 99 unit. See, this this is <laughs> this is an example right here. You don't want him. He's pretty. He's not good until he gets his level 99. So um, it's like, eh, I'll I'll take him for right now. Until I like, I'm not gonna give up on this. I wouldn't give up on this account yet. When you get Laswell, mainly because um, you do get his TMR, but his TMR isn't very good. I recommend bearing with this tutorial for right now. So like right now we didn't get like there is a chance you can get two UR units on that one pool. I don't recommend resetting for that one. I recommend just waiting. Just wait. Alright, it's showing you like all this stuff right here. This is not what I want to talk about. You can watch this on your own, um You can watch this on your own. Like I just want to talk about um other things. I'm not going to go over like all this shit right here. You can do that on your own time. <clears throat> yeah, it's showing you how to enhance. Notice how we didn't do the tutorial. It is new. The, the, the tutorial mission. But as soon as you click on the tutorial mission, you are locked to doing it. So do not click on it. Only focus on rerolls. Also, this tutorial is during the FF7 period, only the FF7 period, mainly because I don't know if they'll change something after the FF7 event and the 1.5 anniversary, so I don't know. So this, so this might be temporary. So, but this is during the FF7 event. Excuse me. Throw. Right. Yeah, we're not doing any story right now. <laughs> I'm not showing off story. Okay, as you can tell, though, we, you get the. This is insane. Look at all that. Look at that. Look at that. You get a free UR unit. I'm going to tell you which unit we're going for, obviously. Then you get shards each week. You will be able to max out someone. It takes 600 unit shards to max out a unit to level to level um I think 75 then you can just use then you can just farm out their um other stuff too then you get these two you get rainbow spears you get and all you have to do is just log in the seven day then you get free gems you get free vizior you get this is what how much now Let's see one two pretty good just know you can't use it on these people, which sucks. I don't know why they did that. 
I don't agree with this. <clears throat> I don't agree with this at all, but it is what it is. You can skip this if you want to, or not. <clears throat> oh god. Oh, my throat is like. This is some quality gameplay. Getting Charlotte Shard, don't worry about this, man, because her event is gonna end anyway at the end of this month. <laughs> you go to end anyway, so you're gonna miss out on this regardless if you're just starting out. Don't even bother to um be sad. Yeah, we got Cloud now. The 1.5 anniversary too. And you wanna check your notices and all this stuff. We're not here for that. We're here for the main bread and butter. So yeah, as you can tell, you got your main stuff. Pay attention to these. It expires on the 12th. So this is during the anniversary. So I might as well just name it like during like anniversary period. Like you want to do this during the anniversary period now. Come 9-12. That's it. September 12th, that is it. So we're going to collect all this. We get a free Tifa. A free juicy Tifa. And you are summon ticket. Get some biz because of that live stream. I like the other reward better because they gave you, I think, 500 because of a guild one. I guess a guild got um the best rank or something like that. That was kind of the best period because you had like what, like 800, 8 or 900. But I mean, this suffice too. I think after this, your default is like 300 or something. <clears throat> so you'll have enough for like two pools. This is like at its peak, the best time. Like you're getting so much free stuff. Yeah, this is what you start off with during the anniversary period. Okay. Now, what you want to do is go into the shop. Let me show off the shop first. Okay. Ignore this part right here. Don't worry about this right now until you get your rank up to like I think in the 100s when it's when this shop starts to get good and spicy. You start to get like weapon materials, recipe materials and all that stuff. That's when this shop starts to get good. I mean, you can get your mod shards and all that stuff. I don't really care for mod, man, because he's just a tank. He just a um, just a um, damage sponger. That's it. He doesn't really do. He's not really good at damage. You can make him like good at damage, but he's not. If you want him, if you like, in a rush to max out Cloud, by all means, pick these up. No, I'm not talking about Amazon Prime because probably people probably don't have Amazon Prime. I probably don't even. Uh, if you do, if you do, you can get the free trial. The only thing that's useful on these is the um, the um, unit summon tickets. You can get units you don't have. All right, let's go over the beginner. Let's go over the first one, the beginner shop. Pick these up. You want these? Trust me. You want the unit enhancing? You want all? You want everything in this shop? Trust me. You want everything in this shop. Everything in this shop is good. Including these right here. Pick these up immediately. These are three free draws now. Three free draws. That's like 600, 6,000 bids worth of draws for just merely 1,500 Vizior. You want it. And then you have 600 left over. And um, you got your unit shards. You want this as well because you get it. You get the fragments and all this stuff. You get the awakening prisms. Now here comes my favorite part. This is what will help you cap out your units early. These bad boys. It's paid. I mean, like, you only be spending. Like, you can just get like. Let's see where is it? Let's see, six hundred. So that'll be. You can like spend seven dollars. I mean, eight technically eight dollars to get this little one right here. It's very cheap. Just buy that. If like if you don't want to spend that much money, just pay buy that right there. 
Or you can buy something even better. The special shop. The 6 dollars ones. These are amazing. You get 2,450 Vizior, paid Vizior. And free Vizior 1,000. That is insane. Then you get two of them from the collab. You want to pick those up. You want to pick those up. These, if you want to cap out on Cloud and Tifa really early, if you want. I wouldn't. I would slowly build them if you're not like. If you just want the units, you just let them sit in your barracks. Somebody else can go over like barracks and all this stuff. I'm just mainly talking about like the beginner shops and all this stuff. But yeah, you want everything here. Then you get one where it's not on. Um, you don't have to do paid vizier, but um, you'll be spending more. But you'll still get 50 unit shards. These, this is also good. I think you think it's 500 in total, so it's pretty good. Use that on your second unit. I mean, use that on your third. Use it on your second unit. Use these on your first unit, like Black Rose Helena, if you want to pull for her, which I do recommend that being a pull. Then you have the newest one, the equipment pack. Pick these up. They may be plus threes, but as a new account, you won't get access to these weapons until their event happens. And as far as I know, we don't know when their event is going to happen. And these can carry you in or in um PvP. Because <clears throat> I go in PvP with plus fours, and I have a plus three um dagger for um my I forget her name, but um basically. Pick these up. I recommend pick them up periodically. Then is then you you can use free viz and not paid viz. Pick them up periodically. Like know what unit you want to use. I would pick up all of these in my honesty because you never know. Because look, you get so much good stuff. You get an ice lance, a free plus three ice lance. And then here's the thing, though. When you pick these up, when you get the materials from the um shop. It, it can add up to this. Then you can make your plus five eventually slowly. As a new account, you're going to slowly build, but these plus fives, I mean plus threes, are good. Trust me. Pick them up, use them. And they will carry you through the story missions, because mainly you'll be grinding out story missions to build up your account rank. So you want to um, pay attention to it as well. You got your other shops here. I don't wanna, I'm not really going to go over these. These are self explanatory. Um, there are other videos that go over these. Like during this period, I recommend picking up this for paid. So it's a pretty good shop. I mean, most of this stuff I did pick up. Um, I did pick up these right here. I'm kind of sketchy on this, so I'm not really, I'm not in a rush to build up Cloud or Tifa, mainly because I'm not a huge FF7 fan. I would recommend these right here, especially Black Rose Helena. She is a must. And Lumera, or any other unit you plan on using. But anyway, let's get to the pulls now. I've already explained this now. Now you know. Make sure you do your beginner's haul. Go and get that out the way, like eventually. Get your tokens out the way. For tokens, I would recommend the item sale price for when you farm like little goat rainbow turtles. There's another video that goes in depth with that. And I would recommend your um. Esper EXP acquisition up. I recommend that one. I recommend just get these two right here. The other ones will just be bonus if you max out these two right here. The um third one I would get is um the vision vision card. Don't worry about equipment item EXP. Uh, don't worry about that. That is ir irrelevant. All right. Oh man, this song. I do not care about the reactor song. I'm sorry. They should have made another song. Like um, Tifa's theme. I would have preferred that better than this. Anyway, let's... um. You want to pull these. You want to do this every day. Even if you don't want to play. Just go in and get your dailies. Like this right here. Let's summon. Go book, please. Just so I can flex on this video. Eh, pretty bad. 
Usually you want to ignore these right here. They're not they're very good. They're not very good. Okay, he's pretty good. That banner. Just a um oh that's a noble liberator banner, I guess. Garbage, Severo, not really that good. Oh, let's see what we get. We get a very lovely, well designed character. Who is using metal? No, <laughs> I don't really care. Okay, we did that, and then you get to the real meat and butter no don't do not pull from this banner this is a trap you do not get soul stars from this banner right here never pull from this unless you're desperate but no never pull from that i would recommend against even if you are desperate the head start you should not pull from this is what you should pull from because it's free you get i think it's the fifth day now so you get five i think it's four or five pulls let's go These are the banners I recommend you pull from. Uh, some there are some mega rare. Okay, we got a summon. Try to get summons. They're the ones you mainly use. In all honesty, the cards and the summons themselves. It's a weird card because it does well with physical physical units. I think I did the accident of um putting them with a. You got little Leela. Little meme. Dang, I got more little Leela shards. Got Ogre. Um, you're starting. You might get like the low tier summons. I think the low tier summons are good. I recommend using them. I'm still using the low tier summons. And I do wonderful in PvP. Like I use, um, Dark Eye, whatever it's called. Um, Bomb. I don't really care for like summoning the um espers and all this stuff. I mainly care for their stats. That's it. And so far, the low tier espers have. I mean, yeah, the low tier espers have like really good stats. Give yourself. A I wish she was good. I would. I would love to use her. Nasha is a pretty good call. Nasha is a pretty good one. Pretty good MR. She's a pretty good MR tank. So I would pair her up with this card right here and the um Esper in the card since she is Ice Elemental. She is a really good one. I think she has a 120 as well. I'm not 100 percent certain. So if you didn't get lucky, she is actually a really good one. Um she is not. She's not that good. She's not really metal friendly right now until she gets her 120. I get it. Her, her kit is kind of weird. You'll mainly be making her like a sub gunner. I never, but then again, I'm not really a big, huge fan of dragoons in any game, in all honesty. So that's just me, my personal feelings on it. Why am I doing these summons? Is it, it makes the video more funner. Oh, you get their card. That's pretty good if you want to use her. Well, no, you use the um, other dude. It's his card. We get Zuzu Zoo. That is another card I use. Even though he has low attack, his kit is still good. I think his kit is still good. I use his card. Like, most people say you should gun for, like, summons and all that stuff. I like the lower tier summons because they're easy to max out they don't require an arm and leg in order to complete the complete missions and all that stuff they're very easy and then their overall stats at the end are really good Zoo is pretty much one of those I'm fast really fast characters so I, I use Zoo to this day and I do very well in PvP like I'm going against whales and dominating with my Luel I 
<laughs> we got another zoo card. Now their vision cards is garbage. I would recommend not using their vision cards, but I would just use summon yet another. Like I said, he's really good. You get him to level ninety nine. All right, we got we got a good one. Okay, they really want me to use Fer Frederica. Federica. Okay. They really want me to use her. You know what? That's fine. Cause we have the tickets as well. I'm just showing this off. Let's see. Oh, I thought it froze. All right, so you get another one. These, if you're new starting now, these does stack up. You see how I'm new and I'm still getting these. All right, let's go. Eh, not very good so far. On my other account, these draws have been lackluster. At least you get the um things from eh, that's another card I don't really care about mainly because it lowers you makes your defense I think I think that's the card that makes your defense like negative five defense that's really bad <laughs> Naya, Naya is a pretty good pretty good unit if you just want to heal her Shadow Links is an amazing pool she is a really good mega you know, mega rare unit. I would recommend using her. She is a dodge tank. And then you get a hat in the um a dodge hat in the shop, which will pair amazingly with her. And then you can get a plus three weapon with her. So I recommend. And it's for Dario. This is Dario's card. Literally Dario's card. It's an evasion card. You can use um with Veneer. I'm kind of I'm using Venera right now. I'm not using this card because I kind of got my Venera as a brute. I kind of would have wanted it for that. I'm not gonna die. Yet. I like Lilith, her design, her spicy design, but she's pretty underwhelming. She's pretty bad. I gotta wait for her 120 to see if she's actually good. I hope she's good in her 120. I really want to use her. Swarcelt? I don't like Swarcelt. I don't really see a use in him. Except when you want to use him for the Isolation Quest. That's probably about it. This is what I mean by this card being bad. Like, look at that defense down. That's disgusting. You get Reaper Killer? I don't really care for this card. I do like how the card looks, though. It looks very spicy. I wish Lilith was good. I would love to use her. Her design is so spicy. But sadly, she's not a good unit. And she's not meta friendly. And if you use her during um, multi, she would probably get kicked out of the room immediately. No fan service allowed. Alright, we get a vision card. We Okay, I can take vision card. Actually, no, this is pretty underwhelming. Let's just skip to the vision cards. And nothing good from this. Like I said, these draws aren't very good. But I recommend pulling from them anyway. It's free. That's all you need to know. And you get that, the collection. If you're doing it now. As of this day, um, August the 28th. Okay, we have a chance for one. If we get if, if two of these light up gold, then we don't. I don't think I've ever seen three. It probably is possible. I don't use Surges, he's bad. I don't use Sasha. You can use her for the selection quiz, probably her only use. <laughs> then she gives her 120 and is actually good. Okay, getting some murmur shards. Okay, that's one gold. Eh, Kaida, she's good for the Salation Quest. She's bad as a unit. Alright, now light up. Oh. El Shirelle is a really good car. Is a really good person. I do like her. Not just for design, but she's actually very useful. Mainly because she has sub on Rune Knight. Then she has um time mage and she has a um mage. I mean um white mage, sorry, white mage white mage. Can get my words out. 
How many pools are there? Good God. Okay, that's it for the draw. Okay. Ignore this. Okay, next what you want to do is, if you're backed up against the wall, you haven't gotten a really good unit, which, eh, our pool has been pretty bad. <laughs> pretty bad. You go to these bad boys. I think it guarantees you a UR unit. Pretty lackluster. You can try with that gold one right there. See if that'll turn into a uh, rainbow. If it doesn't, we're skipping. Okay, there's one shine. Ooh, it's bad. Okay, yeah, we're skipping. What vision card do we get? Oh, that's a pretty good vision card. I like this vision card, really. There's no drawbacks from it. Like, reduces none attack ability activation time. It's pretty good. And it gives dark units and attack res up. Alright, try the next one. Okay, we got some chances. We got two chances. Okay, okay there's one shine. Oh! Yes. Okay, this is a good one. I recommend taking him and keeping him. Because eventually when he gets his 120, he's going to be as good as Dwayne. Eh. 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 Oh, okay, we got, no, we got a second you are. King Oberon, he Oberon, he's good. I mean, King Rob, sorry, King Rob. So I don't really know the characters in here like that. Okay, we got some good pulls. We got, we got Stern, we got Super Stern. This is a really good pool. I will take that to the bank with me. Yeah, I will actually keep this account. Super Stern is really good. Even in a meta now, he's really good. Rob is really good as well as a dodge unit. He actually pairs up well. He actually could pair up well with Super Stern. So I would take him. It's a good um, PvP team. You can just tell we still got that. Alright, let's go. Oh, that guy that needs to shine. We got Big Boy. That needs to shine. Oof. Big oof. Oh, we get him. Oh, we get we get Typhoon. Typhoon is an amazing car. Sadly, we don't have a win unit, but he's good as a mage. Yeah, sadly we don't have a win unit, but he's good for the win selection quest. Okay. Now, after you have did all of this now, you have two things you can do now. If you gotten the unit you wanted, go to the shop and buy those weapons. Those plus three weapons. Buy them. Buy it for whoever you had. But if you didn't, the next thing you do, go on a nine step. Because you get two free pools. Well, first you want to do this. Go on your missions. Now. It's for free to play or pay. Go ahead and pick these up. Pick all these up. Look at that. From all those pools. Then you go jump up in the rank early. <laughs> I'm ignoring that. All right. Then you get your biz back. <laughs> okay. Then, cause you get free, you get free stuff as you pull from these. Then you get, you want to go for strong um, step. What is that step? Six, yeah, you want to go step six and stop there. Right, let's go. All right, we got a chance. I 
that good? Seymour's pretty good. He's a dodge. He's a good dodge unit. And not that I really care for dodging. Okay, you get your rainbow crystal just for URs. It's on 120 them. So I recommend doing that. Alright, then we're gonna go do some more. Oh, we're back in the same boat again where we were lying on one. Eh, bad card. Bad unit. B big boy. He is a card I'm using now. He's really good. He's really good. I do I do like his card. Do not sleep on Float Eye. Float Eye is really good. I guess that's good. I got her. I got more shards of her. I've actually never seen someone use her in PvP. In all honesty. Even though she's good. So I guess... I'm gonna test her out one day, not now. I don't think it's a good time for me for right now. All right, now we get our free pool. Bronze book. I sleep. Someone said this card was good. I don't think it's good. Max HP down by 15% is a deal breaker. I don't care about the everything else. It's a deal breaker. You need all the HP you can get in order to survive a attack from Black Rose Hell no Dwayne. All of the HP you can get. The other card was pretty good as well. But um not what we're here for. Not here for thick assassin card. Alright, let's go. Ooh, a gold book. Is this it? Do we get a good unit? All right, we got two chances. We got a, we got two chances. What is this? I've never used her. I don't know if she's good or not. I do like her design. It really won't even mess, I murmur. Uh, let's, can we get a gold? Uh, Alright. Okay, we got a stern shard. It's good. I like that. Um, I think that's it. I, I don't think I can do any more. Yeah, I don't think I can do it anymore. Unless I unlock another mission. Okay, did we freeze? Hello? <laughs> did it freeze again? Yeah. Is it going to do um, unlock? Nah. Alright. <laughs> it's almost over. <laughs> Hopefully, I unlock something else. is some tutorial. Oh yeah, you get your free energy. Oh okay, god, here we go. I don't want to do all
I want to um, pull for more Yu-Gi-Oh cards and units. Yeah. Way to um, throw it in my face by my rank. Ugh. Shut up. This is not what I'm here for. I'm here for pulls. Like this team, though. Oh God, I don't want to talk about gills. Like, there's someone who I already talked about gills. I just want to talk about like pools for like new players. No more. Alright, let's see if I can get another pool squeeze from this. I don't think I can get another pool. So that might be it. But I think you get the gist of where I'm going coming from. So um then you wanna go into the shop. Since I got a rune stern, these I'm gonna buy like these I would buy, I'm not gonna buy it on this account. I would buy along the way to max out stern to like level 99. Well, with the help of um the other stuff to ignore to get them to level level 99. But oh yeah. I'll go in here and buy since I got stern and I'm 100 percent sure I'm gonna use stern. Go in here, buy the um golden armor for him and the uh where is he? Where is it? Yeah, golden blade. Buy the golden blade for him. But not now though, because you're gonna have to go through like a bunch of tutorials and all that jazz. So um, I would recommend like waiting. Wait, we might be able to do this. Nah, no, we ain't. No, we can't. Not yet. Because of, of the freaking um tutorial, we have to actually do a tutorial mission. Yeah, screw that. But yeah, you get the gist of what I'm talking about. You wanna like organize your units, make them to like rarity. I think rarity is the best one. Yeah, let's go to rarity. So we got we got a solid team. We have Stern, Tifa. We have a, we already have a Dodge Squad. Might have, might affect Stern, Tifa, and Rob. That is a perfect team. Yeah, she's out of place. <laughs> You need to pair her with a time mage and just use the um turbo stress with her to make her viable. So yeah, we have like actually four you use last well if you have his sword, but um that event's not coming back for like a while. Or you can use her, pair up with Stern, is really good, and then Rob is also a good combination for a dodge squad. So I take two. This is actually didn't go too bad. That's going pretty good. It's gonna freeze. Let's end it off with a freeze. Okay. So yeah, we basically did everything of what you should do as a new player. Also, you get her for free for logging in for once. So that means you get shards for her. I'm not really worried about that. I'm saying this off. Now, what you want to do if you're not satisfied. Now, here's the most important thing. Get Mon off your screen. We don't want Mon on our screen. We want best girl where is she the thickest ninja you will ever see <laughs> you want her ignore what happens to her in plot you want her anyway if you're like not satisfied with your account here's what you do you go back to return to title you don't have to log out the emulator or anything like that. Go through all it. That takes. This is faster. As a speedrunner, this is faster. Then you wait. 
go to data delete account since it's not locked to your Facebook account delete it confirm yes I want to delete it okay account delete it's gonna go it's gonna make the black screen then you can start again and try again and try again it might take you nine rows might take you ten rows but if you want to recover your old account if you are if you're an older player and you delete your account go to continue and then just link back your Facebook if you remember your Facebook account but yeah that is it thank you for watching hope you like this tutorial and bye if you're a new player I recommend re-rolling re-roll for I would rec recommend re-rolling for a meta character like um like I re-roll for Venera Venera is actually a really good unit my squad is really good right now I have a Venera, Luel and um Forget the second unit I got. I think it's the math chick that you get from the beginning. Yeah, I have a pretty solid team right now, and they're carrying me. Like I'm taking down some top tier people who um who are best at the game. Like in the guild battle, I just took down like a top tier guy. And my team and um everybody's not even maxed out. Like I have um Luel at like 115. I have um I have Veneer maxed out to like 120. I forget who my second unit is. I forget it's the chick with the glasses you get from um, summoning early game. I maxed her. I I maxed her out. Got her to like level 99. Since that's her cap, and she's a math mathematician. So we're doing well. So that is it for new players. So that is it. Thank you for watching. I'm out. Bye.